Yesterday we have announced a seminar, Warrior Strategy Seminar, a seminar that lasts for 15 weeks and teaches all kinds of strategies to use in combat. Um, a lot of emails came in and different questions came in. One question stood out and a few of them came in yesterday and a few of them came in today and I figured that since so many people have these questions it's worthy of making a short video about it. The question is about the first five weeks of the seminar. Um, in the description you can see that the seminar lasts for 15 weeks, first five weeks is conditioning. Okay? And then the strategies, the applications are in second and third five weeks. So the question is why spend one third on conditioning? Okay? Um, there's many ways to answer that, but let's use this analogy. If there's an army, and an army have to have certain formation, before the battle, in the middle of the battle, after the battle, and you have your soldiers stand in certain lines, then they run, they link up, they make certain other lines, and then they have to walk in formation, run in formation, move at certain angles. Now, you can explain the strategy to your soldiers on paper, you could show it to them, they can know how to do it, but when the combat comes and they have to do this, they're not able to do it. They're not able to run where they're supposed to run. Maybe they don't have the strength. Maybe they don't have the endurance. Okay, maybe they can't run fast enough. Maybe they can't run uphill. Maybe they can't carry the ammunition on them. Whatever the case might be. So the strategy will fail if the soldiers are not able to carry out the strategy. Same exact thing happens with conditioning. If you're not conditioned, you're not going to be able to do this stuff. Okay, it seems like everyone is in shape. Everyone does the squats and the jumping jacks and the sit-ups and basic exercise, but the exercises that are used in conditioning, they start with basic and they go into very advanced and specific routines, specific exercises, exercises specific for the movement that you're going to be using, for the strategies that you're going to be using. Sometimes you have to have agility, change direction quickly. Sometimes you have to have starting speed, dynamic balance, okay? And to have that, you need certain muscles in your body to work in certain way to let you do that, okay? If you can't do it, it doesn't matter if you know the strategies, if you can use them, if you know what to do against a fast guy, a big guy, someone with long reach, someone who changes the tempo, or any other advantage. It doesn't matter if you know what you can do, because you can you know it in your head, but physically you can't do it. And what conditioning does, it allows your body to actually do what your head is thinking. Okay? So what I did was, we put together a little piece, and you can see it, a couple of demonstrations of what's happening in a condition. A lot of it is footwork. Very often it's not the actual footwork, it's measurement. Okay? It's a footwork that allows you to stay in balance. It allows you to learn balance, allows you to learn proper stepping, um, many different things. And a lot of it is strengthening, special exercises, strengthening your legs, strengthening your core so that you're not off balance, so that you can accelerate quickly, decelerate quickly, change angles quickly everything that's needed to carry out the strategy. Okay, so what you're going to see is a very short clip demonstrating some of the exercises used in the first five weeks of the seminar. Okay, now that you have an idea of what the condition exercises are and how they go, they start from week one, very basic, and they build up rather quickly to advance and specific exercises in week five, and that prepares you to be able to do all the strategies and everything, all the tactics that can be taught in second and third five weeks of the seminar. If you have any more questions, you're welcome to write to Info at Elastic Steel, or you can post it on Poleagic.com and hopefully that will give you some idea of what the seminar is about and how it's going to go.